Here we have a sad math question on quadratics. Okay, let's go to the question. X squared negative 34, X plus 2, C equals to 0. In the given equation, C is a constant. Uh, the equation has no real solutions if C is greater than N. So what is the least uh, possible value of N? Okay, so whenever we have a question in quadratic equation about uh, the real solutions or imaginary solution, uh, so first we have to make sure the given quadratic equation uh, is in the form of AX squared plus to BX plus to C equals to zero. So in case of the given quadratic equation is not in this form, our first work is to write the given quadratic equation in this form, but uh, the quadratic equation in our problem is exactly in this form. Okay, so we have to find the value of the discriminant. What is the discriminant? So there is nothing but the expression uh, that is b square negative 4ac. So I have to find the value of this discriminant because it discriminates the nature of the roots of a quadratic equation. That is, so whether the two roots are uh, real, uh, real and equal, or real and unequal, or imaginary, irrational, whatever it is. So everything is decided by the value of this expression b square negative 4ac. Since it discriminates the nature of the roots of a quadratic equation, so we consider this expression b square negative 4ac as discriminant. Okay, so we have to get the value of this. Uh, we have to get the value of this discriminant b square negative 4ac. So for that, we need the value of b a c. Okay, now let's compare the given quadratic equation and the one we have over here. So when I compare these two, what's the value of a? So the value of a is the coefficient of x square. What's the coefficient of x square in our quadratic equation? We don't have any number in front of uh, x square, so we have to assume there is one. So the coefficient of x square in our uh, equation is one. So the value of a is equal to one. So the value of b is the coefficient of x. So that means uh, here the coefficient of x in our quadratic equation is negative 34. So b is equal to negative 34. And uh, so for C, uh, we have the same C in our equation also. So we can write C equals to C. The question says uh, the equation, I mean the given quadratic equation has no real solution. Okay, if a quadratic equation has no real solution, uh, then the value of the discount B square negative 4AC must be negative, that is uh, less than zero. So always we have to remember this. Uh, for whenever a quadratic equation has no real solutions, uh, uh, and also uh, please make sure the given quadratic equation has to be in this form, a x squared plus b x plus c. In that case, uh, I mean, uh, when the quadratic equation has no real solution, uh, then the value of the discount b square negative four ac must be negative, that is less than zero. Okay, now in this inequality, we have to plug in the values for b, a, c. So for b, we have uh, negative 34, so negative 34, the whole square, negative four times the value of a is one. And for C, we have C itself, so we can plug in C for C, so uh, less than zero. And uh, here, uh, this square is applicable for the complete stuff we have inside the parenthesis. So whenever I take even exponent for negative sign, it will become positive. So uh, the evaluation of this power will become a positive value. And when you take 34 square, it will become 1156. Negative four times one is four, four times C is four C, less than zero. Okay, so now let me write the same inequality over here. That, that is 1156.94 C less than zero. Okay, our aim is to solve for C. So for that, I have to get rid of the values around the value around the C. So first, let me get rid of this uh, 1156. For that, I have to subtract uh, 1156 from both sides. So this uh, positive 1156 and uh, negative 1156 will cancel out. Then I get negative 4 C less than negative 1156. Okay, now to solve for C, what I need to do is I have to get rid of this uh, negative 4, which is multiplied by C. So for that, I have to divide, uh, so both these quantities by negative 4. So let me divide negative 4C by negative 4, and also negative 1156 by negative 4. Okay, in an inequality, whenever uh, I multiply uh, both sides of the inequality by the same negative number, or divide by the same negative number, I have to flip the inequality sign. So here I have divided the, both the quantities over here by a negative number, by the same negative number, negative four. So I have to flip this inequality sign. Already it's a lesson, so it has to be changed to greater than. Okay, so this negative four, negative four will cancel out. C is greater than. So this negative, negative will cancel out. And when I divide 1,156 by four, I'm getting 289. Okay, now let's take the condition given in the question that is C is uh, greater than N. So what value do we have uh, at the place of N? We have 289. And also the question says, uh, the question is not simply asking to find the value of N. The question is asking us to find the least possible value of N. Okay, so here we got the result that C has to be greater than 289 if the equation, given equation has no real solution. Because uh, since the given uh, quadratic equation has no real solution, according to the question, we have taken the value of the discriminant over here as uh, negative, that is less than zero. So in that case, uh, we got C is greater than 289. So like, uh, can I take N is equal to 200, uh, can I take a value uh, for N, which is less than 289? 
For example, if I take uh, n is equal to uh, 288, that means uh, I'm taking value for n, which is less than 289. Because uh, um, uh, according to the question, I have to get the smallest value for n, that is the least possible value of n. So that's why I, I'm taking uh, a value which is smaller than uh, the value what I get over here, that is 288 I'm taking. So what will happen? So then uh, c greater than n uh, will become what? c greater than 288. So, but uh, the result what we got from our calculation is C has to be greater than 289. If I take a value for N, which is less than this one, so I'm getting uh, the result C greater than 288. It does not satisfy the result what we got. So, N cannot, we cannot take a value for N, which is less than 289. So, the least possible uh, value for N is 289.